So once you take a look at this, do you see this bus has smashed into a house in Preble County with more than two dozen students on board. The driver is in the hospital tonight. Reporter Jessica Hart spoke with the homeowner about that crash. This can be replaced. Yeah, kids were hurt. That's what matters. And we just hope the best for the driver. The bus was carrying 32 middle and high school students. West College Corner Fire Chief Don Jackson says all of the students are okay, but a couple of parents did take their child to the doctor to get screened for a concussion. And you can just see some of the damage this bus caused to this house. Now, it doesn't look like it pierced the house, but the roof is heavily damaged in the front. Inside the house, I mean, is fine. Uh, there's no damage. Uh, the one, the Butler County Tech crew, mentioned go and turn the electric off. I did. The bus driver was taken to Reed Hospital in Richmond, Indiana. Jackson says he's improving, but we don't know his exact condition. We also don't know what caused the crash. We do know the driver just dropped elementary school kids off at College Corner Union Elementary and was taking the others to the middle and high school. I spoke with the homeowner who says he was out back hanging up laundry when he heard a loud noise. Here in College Corner, Monday is trash day, so trash trucks are running around. It, my first initial thought was Rumpke had dropped one of these dumpsters over here at the school. I came through and climbed up into the bus. Um, the windshield from the bus was covering the driver. I could see about knees down. There wasn't any movement. He actually built this house in the 1980s, but he says he's just grateful all of the students are okay, and he hopes the bus driver will be too. Reporting in Preble County, Jessica Hart, WCPO 9 News.